T to the V to the L to the I to the N to the E TV line. All right, we're here at Comic-Con with the cast of Teen Wolf. Uh, I know it's been a crazy couple days for you guys, so why don't we let out all of our all of our excitement and frustration with a nice big group howl. I thought you were going to say scream. Like, nope. Ah! Screaming is your thing, and you guys do not howl enough. All right, howl on three. One, two, three. Boo! That, okay. That was good. No one did anything interesting. No, I let out, I let out a uh, tremendous amount of air. I'll leave it, I'll leave it <laughs> to the what? It was a very specific amount of air that I let out. Can you do silent, it by yourself? Silent yeah. roars. Do all I do silent roars on set. <laughs> There's not even that, an actual roar on set. I want to hear, hear a, your version of a silent roar. The I actual can... sound? The actual sound is... That's it. That's all it comes out. <laughs> and what are they doing? And then it's all sound effects. Yep. Yes. Okay. So I've said much better than I could do. I've I had I've had a question since the panel the other day that you guys sort of touched upon but didn't totally clarify. Styles and Malia, have they or have they not been to the Bone Zone? <laughs> Wait, what's Whoa. the Bone Zone? Brown chicken. Really? Brown cow. Brown chicken. Brown cow. Have they been intimate? Oh, brown cow. 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 Yeah, uh, uh, blood fills in a certain oh. area. Right. <laughs> I think that's the bone zone. That is, no, that is the definition of a bone yes. zone. It's not an actual bone. It's like it's like. Have, have they have they made love? That's new. Awesome. I think they downhill have. Fast. Yeah, this started downhill. <laughs> Got her. Wow. Jeff. Us. Us. <laughs> yes. Yes, they did. Okay. Yes. I mean, Billy is very physical. I mean, they are as coyotes. So she, that would she, make sense. Did she learn that like in the woods? Instinct. Yeah. Oh, so it's just oh, it's totally natural. Yeah, I remember playing uh, the scene in Eichen House. Because so, you're right. I mean, she's a human. She doesn't probably know how to have sex as a human. Um, <laughs> I remember playing around with like her being nervous, even though she, she's feeling the instinct. She's feeling the the tinkle, <laughs> the tickle. The tinkle, <laughs> tinkle. The tickle. Yeah. You know the tickle you get when you get horny. And she's feeling the tickle, and she didn't know what to do. And then they they figured it out. <laughs> They, I they sure the did. I think the, the tinkle. I think the tinkle. I was gonna say, I mean, for a period, and then they figured it two, out. Two, two wild animals having sex. To just urination might be involved. Why? But every yeah, interview is a month for me. Yeah, I'm just I know, watch. and it makes me. I think, weird. I think part of it's my fault. I think I may have. <laughs> no, you're, you're a whole separate <laughs> issue. Switching gears a little bit. Um, I think it's been great having Liam as an addition this season. Welcome. Yes. Um, how's that been for for you joining the joining the pack and you guys having? Him. Yeah, we, oh. you missed it. Oh, thank you. No yeah, word. You guys were just early. <laughs> no word. Oh, <laughs> no, how, 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 how has it been for you? All right, yeah, no, it's it's great to join the show. I really love the show. Um, I love doing all the supernatural. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> See how he fits in. I love doing yeah. all the supernatural He's stuff. Out of his mind. Um, <laughs> just like the rest of them. Yeah, we're, we're out of our minds. That's yeah. pretty much all I have to say. That's that's why we get along. You just fit in really well. I think you said you just farted. He's a sweet kid. Oh, really well. yeah. See? <laughs> Match made in heaven, right here. <laughs> <laughs> they need like a separate couch. Because um, I've, I've enjoyed the dynamic between uh, Scott and Liam. It's kind of been like what Derek and Scott mm-hmm. had. Exactly. Um, do you feel like he's like cheating on you? Uh, no, I actually, it was really funny. Uh, if there's any time in the show that uh, I actually slipped up and it was a little bit like too much of me, I think, because someone actually pointed that out. Uh, it was a lot of me came through in that scene when uh, I told him like you're gonna be good at this Yeah, because it was for me the most surreal moment I've ever had on set Which was that mm. the scene felt like life. I mean like watching them was he's the same age I was when we started so watching that scene for me felt like watching Derek You know kind of berate Scott a little bit and so it was kind of a, a weird moment of actually watching You know life happening the same way art the scene in, was art yeah. It was really cool. Did you yeah. feel like Richard from Friends? They said hard a little bit yeah. <laughs> yeah. We always compare to Richard from Front. Like, if we were friends, ca- cast members, we always we were like, who would cast Richard? He's, he's, he's Richard. T- he's Tom Selleck. They were Selleck. obsessed with like his facial hair. Uh, <laughs> Dylan O'Brien and Tyler Posey when we first started. So was was season one when Posey couldn't grow facial hair? Yeah. Now he has a very nice beard. Fine. Richard has <laughs> become here. Yeah, I blame him the day that he noticed he could do it. Oh yeah. Yes. We all did. Was I, I was, like I was, I was oh, yeah. looking for Heckle's approval the entire. This is the reason why. I can't believe that I am your age when you first started. Cause like, crazy, right? thinking cool. back, it doesn't feel that long ago. Well, he but so he old. seemed so much older. Yeah, he did. <laughs> like I don't feel that different from when I was 19. No, but, but now he's really old. Now he's really old. Yeah. Mature life. Uh, <laughs> as Ian Bones says, I'm 43. <laughs> <laughs> With this sort of thing where you're you're kind of like passing the torch, people are shifting around. Um, I'm worried. I saw that mid-season trailer. Are you are you dying? You can yes! tell me. These cameras aren't, these cameras aren't actually rolling. You can t- this is uh, the one thing I've, I've learned the most on the show is that when I get questions like that, I say nothing. 
look to me. Or oh, in this case, or I look at Jeff. Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> you can ask him. It's a spoiler, spoiler territory. That's right. Yeah. Couldn't yes. give away something like that. One thing we did see was uh, Derek and, and Braden uh, yes. getting getting down. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you were the hanky panky. <laughs> the bones. The, 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 the bone zone. zone. The, bone the bloody zone. bone zone. Oh. What do you mean? <laughs> and we're back to tinkling. Um, I, I tinkling. feel like well, the world I feel like would not be right if Derek didn't have like a, a lady in his in his loft. So at least at least that's good. Uh, yeah, I mean the the last the last let me see was it last season the season before uh, Derek finally had a, a little love interest and we're <laughs> treading the waters with that again. <laughs> uh, he's zero for two so far on this show in that department. So <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, hopefully I think this time at least she's up front about being violent and killing people. So oh, I think he knows that going in. Never seen her kill. So right? wait, have you seen her kill somebody? No, but she has been aggressive. She does it. she does use a gun. She does use a gun. So I know that she's That's at least that. violent, but. It's Nothing up front. Yeah. It's good to be honest in a relationship. So, yeah, it is good. Well, one, another thing we definitely, definitely saw was uh, you and uh, Ian Bowen both looking, looking jaguar-y is the best, the best thing I can say. Kind of avatar-y, the blue. What, what? Can you tell us anything about that? Ian oh, Bowen's yeah. got a new look. He was previously a large animated CGI yeah. creature. <laughs> And, it's, it's, uh, his, it's his first time. We so. wanted to put makeup on him this time and show a not so alpha monster version of him. And uh, but we changed it a bit to make it somewhere between like uh, Scott and somewhere between Derek's makeup and Ducalion's. Mm. Uh, so he's got a darker skin tone, a little more gray in his uh, in his look, and the the uh, lines of the the brow lines have been crafted more towards uh, Ian's face. Our special effects team does an amazing job. With what that. does the blue mean? Why the blue? Uh, I actually wanted to try different skin tones uh, in the first and second season, but I was told that it would be far too much makeup time and it mm. would add another hour or two to the makeup process. But I love Deucalion's. Yeah, it looks great. Get Deucalion's look. Yeah. Mm -hmm. is, there, is there like a reason though? Uh, blue? Par well, part of it is uh, uh, wolves themselves have different coats, you know, mm -hmm. like a gray or black wolf. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. And I wanted to go more towards like a gray look. That's cool. Yeah. That's so cool. It looks great, We learned so much in these interviews. I know. That's what I've been saying. I really like having Jeff's interviews. We're like, oh my God, we've learned so much about the show. Um, Holland. I know that you, and I actually, I like this, that you said, uh, you know, Lydia, her romantic life is sort of taking a, a backseat this season. Um, but you are aware of the online, the, the craze to get Lydia with... Uh, what is the new STD <laughs> hybrid now? <laughs> no, de Deputy Parish. Like de Deputy Parish. Deputy Parish. I have... Is there a name for it yet? I have said Parish. that... Like, they, rem they remember that she's Lyrish. like 16, 17, right? No, Pitya <laughs> will, I don't think Pitya will be happening. Is that safe to say? Pitya? No. I was like, she's a minor on the show, no. Yeah, she's like 16, 17. Not for long, like not for long. maybe, time. maybe, maybe that is a thing that's happening then, see? She turned, she turned 18. Pretty. It sounds like a place to get lost. On the show in uh, a month and a half, two months. I never know what to say on this show. So, so um, once you turn 18, so maybe Pitya you know, could happen. bang like crazy. I've you said, know what to say on the show, it's the interviews that get troublesome. Yes, exactly, I always give away uh, mm. oh, yeah. <laughs> I always give away. I go, yeah. I'm always so I, I'm always trying not to say too much. Um, I've always said that Lydia has a lot of romantic independence this season, so to speak, because of her past has not yeah. exactly been, you know, <coughs> easy writing. And so, I my main priority is helping out with all the crime solving, as I've <laughs> said. And uh, there could be a potential love interest. I mean, we don't know who it is. We had two goals for Lydia this season. One was to further explore her banshee abilities and to show her struggle with, with wanting to figure it out. Oh, the struggle is real. The struggle is real. <laughs> it's real. Yes. <laughs> and the other was to, um, uh, to bring her back as Styles' as sort of partner in crime solving. So we want we love that they are David and Maddie for me from Moonlighting. Mm -hmm. They really are. They're they're our Fox and Mulder, um, Fox and Mulder. Mulder they're and all Styles and Lydia. <laughs> what did I just say? <laughs> you know, what? you have, you definitely have no idea what he's referencing. I don't. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, I think they make such a good like pair detective pair. Uh, so it was really nice to to get back into that side. Daphne of and Shaggy. <laughs> Daphne and Shaggy. For yes. These, oh, these oh, littles oh. up front. <laughs> Did I break your glasses? No, they're good. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I hope you guys are. Are you guys done film, filming season four? Because you're you're all getting hurt this week. I just headbutted Jr. in the face. Really? <laughs> what? Yeah. So violent. It was it was very accidental, but it happened. You headbutt me. He's got a big old hole in his lip now. I do seriously. He's got tooth mark on his yeah. eye. Yeah, tooth mark. On the other. Age does not exist on the show. He was he was into mixed martial arts. 
and we were, we were doing a, we were passing <laughs> around. We were acting, fighting, and then Call he went like this, and I went like this, <laughs> and we went like this. Um, all right, I do have one. One. Let's let's end on an easy question. Uh, who's the benefactor? Yeah. Uh, that is yeah. easy. There's no answers. That's easy. I say Jeff. We don't. <laughs> Jeff. Say Jeff. Jeff. Would you like any Jeff input on answer. this? It's Jeff, right? <laughs> all right. So Jeff we're all we're, we're bracing ourselves Jeff, for the very meta reveal that Jeff Davis yeah. is the benefactor. Uh, is, when are we gonna find that out? Soon. Uh, is that like like a like a season finale reveal or like before then? It's a uh, sometime in the show. In in oh, the in the course soon. of our third act structure, it sort of ends the climax of the second act and propels us into. Different third act, an unexpected third act, actually. Nice. So that really tells you nothing. 